Hi guys, welcome back to another part of the sexing machine. Um, okay, I finished installing the valves. <clears throat> Excuse me, the 18 pound valves. Uh, I fixed my rotor problem, I hope. I'm hoping I fixed it. Um, it doesn't seem to be that bent right now. And I went ahead and I changed the uh, motor oil. Uh, I see people on other channels um, what they do is they change the oil and they put synthetic oil in there you know what I think it's just a waste of money uh, I've been using uh, regular oil in cars since the uh, late 70s and I've never had a problem with regular oil synthetic oil is almost double the price and uh, I don't think it does that much for your engine except for uh, high heat really high heat so yeah well it's your choice you want to spend the money I'd rather save the money to buy parts to build other things so anyway I just put regular oil in it and uh, what I need to do is I'm gonna put the spoiler on and then I'm gonna get somebody out somebody to help me carry it outside and we're gonna do that speed test cool cool Okay guys, sorry for that last portion of the video. Um, I tried to record this part right now and I still didn't get any sound. The reason why the vibration of the go-kart while I was riding for some reason turned the audio off. So that's why the last part, just before this one, has no audio. What I was trying to say there is that yeah, I, I had the camera on the tripod pointing it at the phone for you guys to see the RPMs and that. But um, the camera loosened off and started turning back and forth uh, as I was writing it. And I was also trying to explain what I had to do with the converter, which is tweak it. So I'm going to have to remove the gas tank to tweak it. I can't get in there at that spring without removing the gas tank. So, um, yeah, I, I couldn't show you uh, exactly on the phone how fast it was going, but you can take my word for it. It went 38 miles per hour, and as soon as it hits the 38 mile per hour, you can feel the governor kicking in. Like, you feel the go-kart wanting to go, and then all of a sudden it just backs off a little bit. It doesn't actually back off to give you less mile per hour but you can feel that the governor just kicked in so um yeah so with the governor it's 38 miles per hour i'm gonna tweak the governor on my next video because i gotta remove the tank and everything and it's gonna rain again so 
I'll do a video with the governor uh, tweaked next time. I, I got to try to figure out a way to get this camera to stay steady on the phone, on my phone, while I'm driving. If not, I don't have the right equipment for it. I don't have the right uh, hold downs for the camera or anything. So, if I can't give you a, a, a picture of the phone at the speed, you're going to have to take my word for it. But honestly, even if the cart does go faster with the governor tweaked, I will not keep it tweaked. This cart, honestly, 38 miles per hour in a car does not does not seem fast. But if you're sitting in that go-kart and you're going 38 miles per hour, that thing seems fast. On this go-kart anyway. So... I promised I would do the run with the with the uh, governor tweaked, and I will do that, but I will not keep it that way. I'm just going to leave the governor as it is, and um, like I said, it's fast enough that way. The steering modification improved the steering by 50%. So, yeah, the Ackerman helped. The steering and the springs on the front also helped. So that was cool. That was a good idea to do that. Anyway, stay tuned for that video. Um, David Johnson, Atzar, Josh Kylan. Cheers, guys.